And so you will want to get yourself really comfortable. If you're tired at all, um, do sit up. And all you have to do is, um, is to just follow along. And I invite you to also to try to bring in all of your senses as well. And if we get to a place and something isn't really appearing to you, then I invite you to just make it up. Just whatever the first thing that comes to your mind, just go with it, you know? Don't, don't overthink it. Just really relax into things and don't, don't stress about it. If there's something that you get really stuck on and um, you want to come back and do it again, you can. So it really lets go of a lot of pressure, right? And I invite you, of course, to close your eyes. Just take a minute with your breath. And I want you with your breath right now to take one deep breath that really lets go of any sort of anticipation or anxiety or worries about what is about to be happening. And another deep breath to really let go of any perceptions of, of what you think is about to be happening too. So I'm going to invite you to imagine yourself in a beautiful meadow where the grass is so lush and vibrant green. And there's little yellow flowers sprinkled throughout this meadow. See if you can get a sense of the sun shining down on your face. Not too hot, just right. Really allowing it to sort of invigorate you and inspire you. See if you can notice the little details. The, the veins on a leaf little ladybugs on a, on a flower. You can see some butterflies flitting about. It is all just a very peaceful, beautiful space. And I invite you to walk through this meadow just slowly and mindfully taking in the feel of the earth beneath your feet feeling the breeze just gentle you're going to notice see if you can find a little portal down into the earth something that is very inviting, very welcoming, like a little rabbit hole. And it's, it's calling to you with a, a coolness and a motherly holding. And it is just the right size for you to fit into or you become just the right size to fit into this little, this little portal, this little rabbit hole down into the earth where you can be really welcomed by that nourishing space. And as you travel through this portal, allow yourself to get a sense of this cool soil that you're passing through. 
Maybe you can feel some of the roots of trees really stabilizing, holding everything nice and firm. And you can see up ahead, you can see the sun is shining on the other side of this tunnel. So taking your time to walk through this portal, really taking in the coolness and gently stepping into the bright sun shining on the other side and giving yourself time to let your eyes adjust and coming out into the light. And you've come into another meadow is also inviting. It's green. There's flowers. And you can see that there is an, an animal, an animal spirit guide waiting for you there. And this may be one that you know very well. Or it may be one that is brand new. And if you do not see one right away, just pause for a minute and let the very first animal that comes to your mind, just allow it. And so here too, taking a few minutes to take in the little details of your animal spirit guide. Notice the look in its eye. Notice the feel of the fur or the skin or the feathers. And we're going to ask this animal guide to bring you through the meadow and over the hills to find a shepherd. You're going to find a shepherd who is one that follows the lay of the land. He's the one who reads the signs and signals of the world around him. And he is one who travels guided both by sun and star. So just allow yourself to follow, follow your animal guide through the meadows, over the hills, to find the shepherd. And when you arrive and you see him sitting there with his flock and his staff, maybe he has a flute in his pocket, and his clothes are all made of cottons and natural fibers, and he feels like a very friendly fellow. So when you arrive to him, introduce yourself, either with your heart or a spirit name or a name that you are known by. And I want you to reach into your pocket and pull out some, some food that you magically have wrapped up there to offer to him as a gift. 
Maybe it's some warm, fresh baked buns or some cookies, or some fruit. And then we're going to thank him for giving you a word or a vow or a pledge of commitment to self soul tending, one that aligns you with the next best steps on your soul path. Let him speak the words that you need to hear most right now. Words that remind you when you're feeling lost. And spend some time here letting your vows of commitment to soul tending come through. And you can ask him to keep them very simple and memorable. And when you feel you have received a word or a vow, your personal commitment, soul tending, reach into your magic pocket again to pull out a gift of gratitude. And whatever you pull out of your pocket is just right. And offer it to him. going to turn back to your spirit animal and follow them over the hills, through the grass, right to the mouth of the portal where it came down through. And here is a time where you can spend a moment and offer another gift to your spirit guide for leading you today and for being with you at this time. Whatever you pull out of your pocket is just right. And you can take a moment here to ask a question 
or to receive a healing or a gift in return. So bring yourself now back into that cool earth rabbit hole tunnel portal where you can once again step into the, the gentle holding of the earth, feeling the coolness of the soil around you, noticing how the stability of the roots holding everything together. Taking your time to pass through, you can see ahead where the sun is shining. And see if you can smell the smell of the earth as you go. And maybe you can smell the flowers of the meadow calling you through. And taking time to come all the way out back into that beautiful lush green meadow with the yellow flowers. Feeling the sun overhead warming you. Getting a sense too of where all the little butterflies are. The bees are in the flowers. Feeling the earth beneath your feet. And looking at those little details of the, the leaves. And as you stand in this place, just breathe for a minute. And let your breath connect you back to your body. And welcome all of yourself into your body. And gently, gently get a sense of the room that you are in. Gently, gently bringing yourself fully into your space. Taking some really deep breaths to really invigorate and reanimate your body stretch, wiggle your fingers and toes, rub your face, get a drink of water or tea if you have it, and really wake yourself back up. And if you want to take a minute right now to write down any of the words that might have come or the impressions 